Megan Murley has been scheduled to give a keynote speech at the South by Southwest Conference in Austin, Texas in 2024. However, her upcoming appearance with media personalities like Katie Couric and Brooke Shields has already faced strong backlash online. Critics have labeled her as a grifter who contributes nothing but empty words. The conference organizers recently announced a Women's Day panel titled Breaking Barriers, Challenging Stereotypes, Working Towards a Healthier Society via an Instagram post on March 8th, International Women's Day. Megan, along with Katie Couric, Brooke Shields, Nancy Wang Yuan, and Aaron Haynes will participate in a conversation aimed at breaking barriers, challenging stereotypes, and promoting a healthier society on and off screens. While some Instagram users expressed genuine excitement about listening to Megan, the comment section also contained scathing criticism. Detractors questioned Megan's inclusion on the panel of prominent female voices, accusing her of contributing empty words and dismissing her as a grifter. Some comments took personal shots at her, calling her a narcissist and expressing disgust. The conference organizers had to turn off comments on all social media posts mentioning Megan, which suggests they might be embarrassed by the negative response. The panel's topic is breaking barriers, shaping narratives, how women lead on and off the screen. It aims to address women's representation in media and entertainment, highlighting the progress made but acknowledging the work that still needs to be done, especially for women of color and mothers. The impact of social media on the mental health of teenage girls, in particular, will also be discussed. Two prominent women on the panel, Brooke Shields and Katie Couric, stand out due to their shared prominence and influence. Their strong connection is emphasized by Katie being a guest on Brooke's podcast and later having Brooke as a guest on her own podcast. Both women have had careers spanning over four decades and are committed to empowering women in various spheres. They discuss their work, challenges faced as women, and their charitable causes. The panelists are likely to respond to Meghan Markle with grace and kindness, considering their extensive experience in dealing with publicity and PR. While they may not engage in public snark, their private conversations afterward remain unknown. Nancy Wang Yuan, a sociologist and author specializing in race and ethnicity within film, television, and new media, brings a unique perspective to Meghan Markle's journey and success. Her insights on Meghan's representation of herself as Caucasian and her predominantly white connections will undoubtedly be intriguing. The moderator, Aaron Haynes, is an award-winning political journalist, particularly focusing on race, gender, and politics. Her impressive background includes working for esteemed publications and teaching a class on black women and the 2020 election at Princeton University. The fact that Aaron achieved success through her own hard work rather than relying on family wealth or royal connections might create a sense of embarrassment for Meghan Markle, should she be aware of Aaron's backstory. Whether Aaron knows Meghan Markle's story or if Meghan attempts to bond over shared experiences of racism within the British royal family remains to be seen.